Welcome to today's video. Thank you so much Naughty Knickers for sponsoring today's video. So I got home just now and my package was delivered so I'm so excited. I have to tell you guys about this. What it is, is it's a subscription. You pay $3.99 a month and you get a delivery every other month of underwear. So if you're like me, I honestly hate shopping for underwear and I just never know what to get. I kind of just think that this is perfect because it's like a little nice surprise and they mail it to you without hassle. It's so affordable and such great quality. And the good thing about them is they come in every size that you would possibly need. They range from extra small to 3XL. So literally there's something out there for everyone. They have three different options that you can get. They have the nice option, which is just like regular underwear. Um, so that doesn't include like thongs or G-strings, anything like that. And then they have the naughty subscription. So that is just G-strings, thongs, or you could do sugar and spice, which is what I did because I like a mixture of variety. I'm going to show you guys the underwear that I got. These are brand new. I just unwrapped them so i'll just show you guys the quality and how adorable these are and this is just such a perfect little gift to get your significant other maybe just get this for valentine's as a little surprise present it's so affordable all year long it's just something that your significant other would really love or even a family member your best friend honestly i would get this for you know one of my girlfriends i think it's so affordable and so nice so this is the first one it's just like this really really pretty hot pink and this one is a thong and you can see that it has like a ribbed material and these are so stretchy like the material is so perfect i think these would be honestly amazing for like working out when you want to wear like a thong but you don't want something like super super snug you want it like stretchy underneath your leggings so I think that these are just so amazing. I can't wait to wear these. Next we have these like, this is kind of like a rose mauve, like a blush color. And once again, like it's crazy because each pair is like a different material, but you could just tell like it's such great quality. Like this is honestly like a silky material. And then it has the lace at the bottom, which I think is so cute. And then it says Naughty Knickers here on the side. I don't know if you can see it right here in gold, which is just so cute. And then last but not least, these are my absolute favorite. I can't get over how stinking cute these are. So here's the last pair. These are so cute. They are a little risque, but so adorable. As you can see, it's like this mesh lacy material and then here is the back so yeah i really really love these and like i said such a great price i cannot wait to wash all of these and wear them i just think that i'm gonna love them i'll leave the link down below everything that you need to know about them i'll leave their instagram and you guys can check them out and yeah i just got back from durango so i'm gonna roll the rest of the vlog it was really fun we left Friday night and we just got back like literally like an hour ago. We are actually going somewhere for the weekend for once. We haven't been anywhere in such a long time it feels like. So I'm just kind of packing, getting stuff together. We are going snowboarding in Purgatory. If you are from New Mexico, you probably know where that's at, but we're going with a few friends. It is um, AJ's friend's birthday so we're kind of celebrating that aj just dropped beckham off at my mom's house so i need to run to the store and then i need to go to target just to get a few other little things that we need like little snacks and stuff like that but yeah i am like 85 percent packed so yeah i feel like i'm probably packing way too much as usual every girl's problem every girl's issue 
but that's fine. It's better to be over prepared than under prepared. Am I right? Get in my shoes. I was gonna actually try washing my shoes in the washing machine because they're really, really dirty, but I figure they're probably gonna get really dirty this weekend anyway, so I'm not gonna do that. And honestly, I don't even know if wearing white tennis shoes is a good idea. Probably not. But they're the only tennis shoes I have, believe it or not, that actually like fit me. Um, yeah, so I need to get new shoes eventually. I just got back from the store and I wasn't planning on getting half of this stuff, okay? It just happened. I have no self-control. So I decided to make it into a little haul for you guys because I got some really cool stuff. So I'm gonna start off with Sportsman's Warehouse. Um, I'm not sure if these stores are all over or what, but basically Sportsman's Warehouse is kind of like uh, outdoorsy kind of store they saw like um, a lot of hunting stuff camping stuff things of that nature and I went there because I had a gift card from Christmas and I needed a jacket for this weekend so I thought okay let me go look there and see if I can find a jacket so I got this jacket, it was on sale, and it is Columbia. Let me see if I could find the tag. It was, let's see. It was like missing a tag, so the guy made one, but I think he forgot to put it in the bag. But anyway, this was regular, I think 120, and it was on sale for $40. And it's a Columbia jacket, which is awesome because that is such a great brand. So it's this really pretty like sea green color. I don't know if you can tell on camera the color, but it's so pretty, it's lightweight. And there was only this one left, so I figured it was meant to be. And I got this in a size large. It's not that big, but I wanted it a little bit bigger that way I could fit it over another jacket if I wanted to or a hoodie or something like that so I got this since we are going snowboarding I wanted something to kind of keep my face warm and you have to wear a face mask so um, this is a face shield it's like one of those like scarf looking ones so hopefully this is comfortable it seems like it's pretty lightweight so Got that, this was only $14.99. And then I was walking by and I know that everyone has these hats and I've honestly always wanted one. So, I'm so excited. It was only $16.99. I'll show you guys what it looks like. So cute. I feel like these are just so common, everyone in their moms and dogs and sisters have them but you know it's fine i think it's cute so got that now on to target so i actually found this jacket in the men's section and it was i think 70 percent off but this was only 24 dollars and it's a puffer jacket it's the brand goodfellow and i got it in a size small since it is men's and it fits like a little big so that's nice so it's kind of in this like bone ash cream color, whatever you want to call it. I don't know if you can tell, but let me see if I can show you how it looks. But it's so cute. It looks like it's an expensive brand, but it's from Target. So really cute, really thick and warm. So that'll be perfect for this weekend as well. And then... I got a few, sorry, I'm out of breath. I got a few random little things. I really do need new makeup brushes. I got some Morphe brushes a while back and the brush has like completely came off of like the handle. So I need to just throw them away because every time I use them, I get so annoyed because I have to like hold it a weird way. So I got some Sonia Kashuk brushes. It comes with nine brushers brushers 
nine brushes and a roller ball came in this clear little makeup bag and look at how gorgeous these are they're like a mint green and i am just obsessed and then the actual brush is kind of like a light gray taupe color i'm so 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 excited and now i can throw out all my gross old makeup brushes that i need to throw out i got some ranch because i go through ranch like crazy so we've been out of it for a while every time i'm at the store i always forget to get it coffee creamer i get the starbucks caramel macchiato honestly i get any flavor they have this was the only one they have so i'm fine with that i got a loofah and then some body butter this is the raw sugar brand i just needed a good lotion for like traveling because all my lotions are like the tubs of lotion i don't really like taking that big old thing so i just got this it's rose water and cucumber hopefully it smells good can't really smell it and then i have two items which i'm so so excited about so start off with this one i got this lamp i've been looking for a lamp for my office for months and i finally finally found one that i love so it's like a wooden base and it's like a round ball and then the lampshade it's just so cute and perfect 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 size for my office i cannot wait baby sorry she's licking herself that's kind of gross but anyway um i got this lamp which is so beautiful i think it's wow okay it is a studio mcgee threshold threshold designed with studio mcgee i don't know if you can see it but it's so beautiful it has this little detailing in the middle kind of like a little wrap around and it's so so cute this was only 40 dollars, and i love how you can turn it on with like this little thing it's kind of different so one thing that i did forget is light bulbs i'm gonna need light bulbs because it didn't come with any which is fine um but yeah i'm out of breath i need to finish packing if you find the one you should never give her up i think it's the way life changes when in love yeah i surround my soul with the positivity that's why i don't worry about the things that i don't see yeah these days i don't worry about much i think we should have some more fun i still dream about the days when we were young i'll take a hit and still finish and run yeah yeah So this is what the little ski lodge resort thing looks like. We're way up here and let me see if I could adjust the lighting. There we go. So you can see people walking down and then there's the ski lift and I am terrified. I've been snowboarding I think three times before but they're all like super super spaced out so yeah first two times were like a total fail i did horrible of course and the last time we went which was like i think yeah it was definitely three years ago and i hurt myself really really bad and felt like i broke my entire rib cage <laughs> so yeah, I haven't been since then, so I'm terrified. And we're with a small group of people, but if there was like one other person that wasn't gonna be snowboarding, I would totally be like, cool, I'll be right with you. My friend is watching Phoebe and she keeps like sending me cute pictures and stuff. And she just texts me saying she's the best dog in the planet, so I'm so glad that Phoebe is behaving so yeah we're gonna get ready to walk down now I'm gonna have to rent a helmet and stuff like that so um, I'll see you when we get back It's all 
Oh, I forgot Dixie's here. <laughs> Come on in. Come say hi to us. <laughs> 